Here's a quick trick I want to share with you. We're told, without a calculator, calculate 2022 squared minus 1 over 2023. The trick for calculating this without a calculator is to realize two things. First of all, 2023 is 1 more than 2022. Secondly, 1, that is the difference between these two numbers, is the number that's being subtracted on this numerator. With that in mind, here's the trick. Using the fact that 1 is equal to 1 squared, we can rewrite this numerator as a difference of 2 squares. Here's what I mean. We can rewrite this as 2022 squared minus 1 squared, and that's still over 2023. Now, using the fact that when we have a squared minus b squared, we can write that in factored form as a plus b times a minus b, we can now rewrite all of this as... 2022 plus 1 times 2022 minus 1, and all of that is written over 2023. Now this first pair of parentheses, well, that turns into 2023, so we have 2023 times the second pair of parentheses, which will be 2021. So that's 2023 times 2021, and that's still over 2023. Finally, cancelling out the 2023 on the numerator with the 2023 on the denominator, we're left with the answer. It's 2021. And there we go.